Good evening, viewer. Welcome to our Glory Globe TV Earth's breaking news from Ukraine. Yes, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky on Thursday, May 16, said the current military situation in Kharkiv's northeastern region was extremely difficult. However, he said it will still under control. His statement came following his meeting with the military chiefs near the front line. The situation in the Kharkiv region is generally under control and our soldiers are inflicting significant losses on the occupier. However, the area remains extremely difficult. We are reinforcing our units, he said in a post on his official telegram channel. The Ukrainian military had earlier said that it had managed to halt Russia's advances in some of the places partially. Our defense forces have partially stabilized the situation. The advance of the enemy in certain zones and localities has been halted. Army spokesman Najar Volosin said on state TV on Thursday. In a daily briefing, Ukraine's general staff said its forces had significantly reduced the activity of the Russian occupiers. But the enemy is still trying to create the conditions for further advances. Volosin warned. Kaib also accused the Russian army of claiming the lives of dozens of civilians in the territory that it had taken control of the last week. According to operational information, the Russian military trying to gain a foothold in the city did not allow local residents to evacuate. They began abducting people and driving them to basements, Interior Minister Igor Klimenko said on Telegram. There are also reports of the first shootings of civilians by the Russian military, he said, further adding that the probe into the war crimes was now open. One of the residents of Bobachangs tried to escape on foot, refused to follow the commands of the invaders and were killed by the Russians. Being thus exclusive report, Glory Globe TV, Delhi, Bharat.